Hey, hey! Welcome to the Buzz Hour. This is a late night Buzz Hour. Late night. Um, just thinking about uh, I was doing some guitar riffing here and uh, came up with uh, doing some uh, Uncle Theodore. Anybody know what Uncle Theodore is? Who Uncle Theodore is? Terrible Teddy from the Motor City Madhouse. Ted Nugent. Man, that first album, After the Amboy Dukes, that was uh, killer stuff. Uh, that first Ted Nugent album, that like, uh, they got the one song, Stranglehold, I mean... <laughs> I mean, that riff, <laughs> oh, it's unbelievable. And then he turns it into like a nine, ten minute song uh, with space drums and bass solo, distortion on the bass, Nugent going crazy in the middle, you know, with his... Uh, with his elephant calls. That's what he calls it. Uh, I don't know what he... Who's he... Who's he I mean, does you really want an elephant coming to you? Stomping and running at you, you know, if you're calling them to come over. I mean, come on, Ted. Oh, I don't know. But anyways, he's a hunter. Uh, I'm a grunter, so <laughs> I don't know. Here we go. This was another one. Uh, this was a great riff. Um, all guitar players, you guys need to learn this riff. <laughs> Scratch fever, baby! Oh, sorry about that. Just, uh, I just felt like doing one of them noises. Um, that's it for today. Little bit of Ted Nugent. Uh, it was great stuff. Uh, Derek St. Holmes, the singer on the first album. Uh, a little bit on the second album and also throughout uh, Ted's career. Um, Ted did some vocals too. Um, and then also a little bit of guest vocals from Meatloaf. Did you guys know that? Meatloaf actually sang on some songs. Bad out of hell, Meatloaf. Yeah, that guy. Um, good stuff. So we'll be talking to you. Have a drink with me. And uh, we'll talk another time to uh, uh, reminisce about rock and roll. Uh, the Buzz Hour. Peace out.